Hello everybody! Today we're going to unbox the Mamtech Gaming Keyboard, take a close-up look, plug it in and see it light up. So let's go ahead and open up the box. Please excuse the condition of the box because it's come a long long way and it only had very light packaging. So let's go ahead and open it up anyway. So we have a little user manual here. Okay. And then let's go ahead and remove the keyboard from the box. And of course, the cable as well. Okay, let's Go ahead and remove the sleeve from the cable and take a close-up look at the USB cable and of course give you an idea of the cable length. So I'm going to quickly undo this cable tie here and the second cable tie. There we go. And then, let's take a close-up look at the USB cable. Okay, so it's covered in a fabric braid. And just to give you an idea of the length, there we go, that's the length of the entire cable in the shot and let's go ahead and remove the protective covering from the keyboard so there we go that's the memtech gaming keyboard and you can see there are some quick access function keys in red the very top of the keyboard. And we have some playback and track controls in red on the right hand side of the keyboard. Okay, let's take a look at the underside of the keyboard. And we have some adjustable feet here to raise the height of the keyboard. And we also have some drainage holes as well for spillage, so if you spill your hot drink or cold beverage on it, it will drain right through. So it is spill resistant, which is quite good to know. And just to show you the thickness of the keyboard as well. And of course, you want to hear and sort of like get an idea of the key press and sound. Let me lay it down flat. And uh, this is how I normally type, yes, it is true. What you've heard about me is entirely true. Okay, so I guess at this point, let's go ahead and plug it in already and see it light up. So I'm just gonna plug it into my Alienware laptop that's just off frame here. And straight away, you can see the light come on on the keyboard. 
And let me turn off the lamps there next to me. And hopefully you can see the lights a little bit better. Okay, so let's check out the colors, shall we? So what we do is press the function and scroll up to change the colors. And you can see it instantly changed, so that's blue, red, cyan, yellow, or slightly green actually, purple, light blue, And of course, there is a color changing cycling pulse feature, which you can see it change and fade in sort of like a breathing or heartbeat slow pulse mode. And of course, we can turn it off. And we can also adjust the brightness level so let's do that pressing function and page up or page down to adjust the brightness. So let's see how many levels it can go up. So right now it's at the lower setting. So that's the second level, third, fourth, fifth, sixth, seventh, eighth, ninth, tenth. So there are about 10 levels of brightness. Wait, maybe not. It's really hard to tell because the adjustment is quite fine. So that's the lowest level. Let's do it again. Second, third, fourth, fifth, sixth, seventh, Eight. So there are about eight levels. It's really fine and really hard to tell, but it's nice to know that there are at least eight levels of brightness to play around with and to fine tune to your desired setting. So let's go through the colors one more time. And I'll just give you a close-up look. With the LED lights on, of course. So that's the Memtech Gaming Keyboard. Thanks for watching and happy gaming!